Morning campers. I'm fogging up here. Oh, that's better. Well, just finished the first climb of the day. Oh, no, 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 Andy. The first climb. No, not yet. Well, we're close. <laughs> I keep telling myself uh, we're close. Hmm. I'm sweating buckets. Humidity is right through the roof in the trees. Had a cold night last night. Oh, I mean, it wasn't too bad, but then this morning, oh, it was so cold. I was cold. I didn't want to get up. And then uh, climbing up that hill, I was like, oh, I had too much on, taking stuff off. <laughs> you got to laugh because it's, it's just crazy. But anyway, here's Roblox. Morning. That's good. And uh, yeah, we got a nice view here though. We're almost at the top. I've been here before, you know, I recognize this. Check this out, guys. In fact, if I go right over there, and then just look at that. I know you've seen this before, but it blows your socks off, really. It really does. Isn't that gorgeous? Just absolutely fantastic. There we go. And onward and upward. Well, guys, we finally got out of the trees. Um, now we're going to be going up. Over Tornado Saddle, which is quite a climb, really. But one step at a time. I think, hopefully, you guys can see the trail there. That's where we're going. Right up there. And then uh, we get up there, and then I think we have another little uphill to get to the top of uh, Tornado Pass. So, yeah, I remember coming down here and actually phew, it was hard coming down here because it's, it's pretty steep, it's just steep. So, but anyway, that's what we're looking at. Now you get to see it from the other direction. Oh, I'm starting to feel some strange droplets. Could it be liquid sunshine mm -hmm. i think it might be hope you guys can see this see how far we've come up steep and they have these cairns with orange flashes on them to guide us up I don't think I showed you guys this last day. Of course, it was a big climb coming up. And then you just kind of, the last thing you're thinking about, you just want to get to the top. And then if it's windy, you want to get out of the wind, you know? But yeah, this is the top of the tornado saddle. It's, well, I don't know what to say. It's absolutely fantastic. That's what it is. The old calves were screaming going up there. <laughs> Aren't they, Robot? Hey. Robot was on skittle power. Yeah. Which is good. Skittles. She needed that. That's why I have extra. Because you never know when you're going to need skittle power. Here's Robot coming down. Navigating the scree, scro scree slope. down at the bottom there. Yeah, that's the plan. Yeah. Take a little shot of this. Look at that, eh? Beautiful. Don't know if I took a shot of this on the way up because I think I was so tired. Probably wasn't on my mind. <laughs> All I was thinking about was getting up the top. Hi guys. Oh, 23. 
Oh, wow. Robot, I was just asking Robot how far we did today. She said 23. So, well, 23, that's what we did. Yeah, I mean, we went up over Tornado Pass, so. I mean, it was quite climbing all day. We had to climb out of uh, Cataract Creek. That was a ways up. And then uh, over Tornado Pass. And then we got here, and then the heavens just opened. Wow. It was just pouring. Pouring rain. So we took shelter for a while. We are going to try and go a little further. We took shelter for a while, thinking it was just a shower. But it stayed on for quite a while. And then we decided, okay, well, it's not, it's not going off. Put on our wet-proof jackets, and away we went. And then it started again, like a downpour. So anyway, then it was like we're looking at the sky because we got to this um, campground here. Gee, what's it called again? It's called... What's this campground called, Roblox? This campground? Yeah. Tornado campground? Yeah, we got here. Dutch Creek. Oh, Dutch Creek, yeah. I camped here when we were going the other way. So we got to Dutch Creek, and we're looking at the sky, and we're like, whoa, like it looks like we're going to get more rain. So, and in fact, we did get some more rain, because the tents, tents got, got water um, droplets on it. So then we thought, okay, well, we'll set up the tents here because we were going to go on a bit further. We might as well set up the tents here because it looks like we're in for more rain. So at least we got it, the tents set up while it was still dry. And then we're expecting rain for tonight. <laughs> so we'll see how that goes. But anyway... It was a really nice day. Robot really enjoyed going over turn up to Tornado and then down the other side. It was it was really nice. She really enjoyed that. So did I actually. It was nice to do it the other direction actually. It wasn't easy getting up there, like I said before, but um Yeah, that was the day. So tomorrow Tomorrow we are going to Morning Lake. Morning Lake Campground? That's where we're trying to head for, which actually is a pretty big day. But you know, when I did it the other way, I remember getting here and I wasn't that late. So I'm thinking, I'm not saying it's an easy day, but I'm saying, you know, I think you can make pretty good time. And the weather's not meant to be too bad tomorrow. So hopefully... The weather cooperates and uh, we can make some miles and uh, yeah, get to Morning Lake, I think it's called, campground. And then after that, we're into Coleman. So we're pretty excited actually. But uh, yeah, it has, like I say, it hasn't been an easy stretch this. It isn't an easy section. I don't think so. I don't think it's an easy section, but I guess it depends how fast you do it, I suppose. Anyway, we saw four people a day, two guys and a couple, and that was it. There's nobody else here at the campground but us, which is okay. There's room for like maybe a couple other people, but so that's kind of our night. So it was a good day. And uh, we'd have liked to have done a little more, but like I said, we decided that, you know what, no point in keep getting soaked, setting the tents up in the rain, you know, all that kind of good stuff. Might as well take it, take the good uh, while we could get it and uh, 
just means I mean we wouldn't have gone much further we got here around 6 o'clock so we wouldn't have gone much further you know maybe a few k's so wasn't a big deal anyway hope you guys had a good day hope you're having a good night and as always thanks for watching and uh it's good night for me good night